going to be doing the manual muscle test for latissimus dorsi. I'm just going to be showing my partner here the motion and explaining all of the actions as we go through it. So we're going to be starting with the arm up above the head and he's going to be swinging his arm through motion, bringing it behind his back and almost kind of pushing away in this direction here. So as an explanation of those actions, from a flexed position, this is going to be causing extension. The humerus is going through some medial rotation as well as adduction. So we have extension, adduction, and medial rotation at the humeral joint. And every once in a while, this can cause depression of the scapula if it has an attachment to it. So I'm gonna do that one more time, bring it above the back. As a misnomer, some people say put your hand in your back pocket, but again, it's more about lifting your hand away from your sacrum or your lower back with that part. So I'm gonna see if my partner is able to do that all on his own this time. Good, so that is going to be the active range of motion for this muscle. Good. Because it has such a wide range, we're going to be doing some resistance during its range, but we typically get a little bit closer toward its end range instead of up near the top. So I'm gonna have him about here, and I'm gonna be pushing on his arm in the lever to try and get some rotation as well as bringing it up away from his body. So he's gonna hold, my other hand is going to stabilize on the sacrum as I'm going to be pulling his arm away from his body. Five, four, three, two, and one. Good. Starting from arm up above the head. It's okay if you can't wait, quite reach the sacrum right away. But we're going to start with this motion. Go ahead. You're going to step through if you need to, finishing the motion so the hand goes above the head. Let's do that one more time, starting from up here. Go ahead and pull all the way through that motion. And again, finishing with a hand behind the back. Excellent. The last part of this, we're going to lengthen latissimus dorsi. So the reverse actions, we're going to be bringing the arm straight up above the head, which is going to be the opposite of adduction, is abduction, the opposite of extension is flexion. So when you combine those two motions, it's arm straight above the head, and the humerus naturally externally rotates to clear the acromion getting into this position. So you can hold at the humerus, and if you need to, stabilize at the sacrum as we bring that arm straight up above the head for its lengthy position. So that's gonna conclude the manual muscle test and length of lats.